do we know this person? Yeah, he does. <laughs> yeah. I you don't. You don't want to know this yeah, person. Okay, don't. I don't know. <laughs> you might have seen her under a bridge <laughs> driving up yeah. Las Vegas Boulevard. <laughs> <That's horrible. laughs> Um, you know how you drive across that bridge and someone asks you for a riddle before you can cross it? Yeah, yeah that'd be her. Right. Yeah, <laughs> I know her. It's, um. not, it's, <laughs> it's not your proudest moment, you know? If your dream is not as good as Martin Luther King's, don't say it. My dream was not as good. So, <clears throat> I had a dream last night oh. um, that we were. Have you watched the show from? No, that we were no. that we were in like this a goddamn show. We were in like a situation like that, and like me and so this Danny and this dude were arguing with each other. And this dude, he honestly looked like Terry Crews. Yeah, he was that big. Um, and Danny and him got into it about something about like how we were doing something wrong. Or we Danny probably called him N-word. Yeah, okay, he might have. Um, I wasn't sure if that that didn't happen in my dream, but I wouldn't put it past him. Um, and the guy started trying to fight Danny, so I tried to start to fight the guy. And then me and him got in a fight, and he was, like, huge. So I was like, okay, he's going to kill me because we're in a world where there's no laws. Yeah. And I ended up choking him to sleep. And then he woke up, and, like, I came in the room where he I choked him out, and he wasn't there, and I was, like, freaking out. And then he just dapped me up, and we were cool. He was like, hey, man, we got to figure out a way to get out of here. <laughs> hey, I know me and you have a problem right now, but we still got to figure out <laughs> how the fuck we're getting out of this. But town. it scared me because my dreams lately, I've been feeling like I'm really, like, in them. Yeah. And I don't know if that's good or bad. That's good. That's when, when you're really, like, hitting your REM sleep, I think. Like, when you're, like, deep in your sleep. You Do you know? know that, or are you just making that? When you're dreaming, heavy, the heavily dreaming is REM sleep. Yeah, when you're heavily in your dreams. Because like, I feel like it's taking a toll on my body. Okay, I'll now wake... you're being gay. <laughs> no, because I feel like I wake up. Yeah, that's gay. I okay. wake up and I just feel all achy. No, not My achy. It's not good. But I feel like it's... I wake up and I'm like, holy shit, dude, that was fucking crazy. Like, I feel like well, I live. that's just you. Yeah, dude. Yeah. Fucking gay. Okay. Yeah, as he's stuffing half of a banana in his mouth. Yeah. Um, Jeez. I don't chew when I eat bananas. Yeah. <laughs> I was telling someone at work, there was a, a com- I think it was Daniel Tosh or somebody that said like, or no, it was a Daniel female. Tosh was at your work? Yeah. <laughs> no. There was a female comedian that was like, the only non-gay way to eat a banana is if you mush it between your fingers and like lick it out. And I was like, I mean, that's... Sarah, Sarah Silverman. Yeah, it was, yeah. Of course, you would know who it is. She was on Tosh right now, wouldn't she? Um, any, fun, any fun things happening in anyone's life lately? I do want to touch on what you said earlier about the show from. I know Michael's sick of it, but the people don't know. You gotta watch the show. It's about a town. You He's getting just... paid advertising for. Yeah. Right? <laughs> I thought he might have been. Like, yeah. I thought he might have been, and then yeah. I watched it, and I was like, this "Wait, show's... this show is actually like incredible." So you thought it was incredible. Incredible. And you watched season one. You're like, "Wow, this show's incredible." Were you thinking? I watched season one, and I was like, "Okay, this finale, Danny hyped it up. It wasn't as good as." But I But here's what I want to say: Now that you've watched season two is what the finale brings is what is so crazy. You know what I mean? Because it brings the bus, and who's on the bus? That chick's girlfriend, the chick's fiance. Oh, yes. No. It, parks. Crazy. It no. brings that, it bald dude. It brings like, it brings... And the there's bald. theories that who that old lady could be. Yes. No, no. I'm telling you, Michael, you got to watch this show. And I, you that, know me when it comes to shows. Yeah, I know. I You're call gay. you gay. Yeah, yeah. yeah. Don, they want me to watch fucking, what's that show called? House of the Dragon. Other one. The Game f- of Thrones. Game of Thrones. And I'm like, I'm just not into it. Yeah, that's that's different. Uh, where I, I know what From is about. It's more like a mystery thing. Oh, what's going to happen? This and that. Game of Thrones is more like a... Whole life fucking... Yeah, it's, it's a lot more like political than people think. You know, it's like it's like the, the background, like the like the backstabbingness of like, you know, all that. You know, it's like... It it's like, really good. Besides the other gay stuff with the wizards and dragons and shit. Yeah. <laughs> if there was no dragons... There's no wizards. If there wizards. <laughs> If there was no dragons and no, like, mystical shit going on yeah, at all. Yeah, just, like, regular, like, TV. If it was regular, just they were talking about the problems between the North and the this and the that, it would be the best show ever. Yeah. You throw in dragons and all this, it does make it better. <laughs> I just, I can't imagine that. I swear it does. How we sounded? We're sounding all right. Right. <laughs> um, uh, our producer happened to, uh, Yeah. we want to get into that. Um, well, we, we'll get into that. I'm all for... You know, people believe in what they want to believe, bang who you want to bang. But not during the podcast. But, like, if you're trying to run a business, like, let's get serious for a second. Um, Because he said he canceled on them last night already. And I'm like, well, you know. He canceled on who, God? Yeah. Geeks is full-time, baby. (laughs) God don't fucking. I never heard him cancel. Yeah. Oh, trust me. He canceled. Canceled on who? Who do you cancel on? Apparently there was a thing at church and he canceled on them because, well, I'm assuming part of it was our 
recording the press conference, which and then we went to dinner with our family. God forbid that we recorded it. Yeah, I think God. I'm pretty would sure God would want us to go. You guys to go yeah. dinner, dinner with, with your family. family. No, what he wanted him to do was go to that church and stuff their pockets full of money, yeah. so they could fuck kids and it's bullshit. So yeah, this is a good lad. He was on hose last night. Yeah. <laughs> yeah, he was a good game. He, what he said, she looks about 35. I'll give you her face and Eric's face. We're mixing together. Yeah, because um, yeah, there was this 50 something year old chick last night. She had to be 50 plus, yeah. That I was thinking about banging. No, he wasn't. <sighs> you or your uncle? Me. My oh. uncle's married. Oh. To my aunt. Yeah. No, she I was, was trying to tell Danny to, to bang her, and then he kind of. I was like, you know, because she didn't look bad, but then, okay, but then she was chain smoking cigarettes. She was not. She'd be chain smoking her pole. Yes. Yeah, I guess. That's what I, t- I, I told him today if we woke up and he went to that chick's house and banged her. It, he'd be a, it'd be a way better night and way better stories, and there'd be, we'd have a lot more to talk about of course. than we would if him saying. She was smoking a cigarette, so I didn't. If I woke her. up in well, the morning. Or just in general, when you were like fucking 60 years old, you're like, dude, when I was 27, I banged a fucking 55 year old, yeah. Okay, but if I woke up in the morning and she's making porridge for me, <laughs> yeah. I'd be like, okay, I maybe shouldn't have done this. Making no. porridge. Um, that's how you get out before the morning. Have you seen that video of that dude in England? He's like... He, dude, that's a, that's a wild video. man. video. It's like a 90-year-old lady giving him a cup of tea. He's like, how old are you? And she's like, I'm 84. And he's like... <laughs> that's what I'm saying. I, know, and I thought he was going to be older, but when he said his age, he was like, what, 24? Yeah, I was like, like Yo, oh, you're a demon, God. dude. She was like 88. Yeah. No, that's why I said... I just said, like, for Danny, like... This chick didn't look bad at all. She was hot. Yeah, yeah, she was a hot fifty-year-old. She was. The thing is, with those, you're not hot helping yourself, bro. Like, like she definitely was. You don't. Wanting you don't to you think me. you're yes. fucking them? Like, well, I'm gonna go fuck this hot fifty-year-old. No, they're gonna fuck you, bro. Yeah, you're hard. Gonna, yeah, bro. That sounds good. It is good. I like that, dude. And you never know. Like, like I said, she because like you got to think about it like this. She could have been divorced from a guy with money, fucking took his house. You know, she could have drove there in an Escalade. Like, you don't know what she her deal was. Worst case scenario, she drives a fucking yeah. Camry. Escalade. What is no. she from fucking 2002? Worst case scenario, I'm she gives you chlamydia. Yeah. You know? And that you could treat that easily. Yeah. Worst you, case scenario, you have a condom in your wallet. Then I did. Yeah. Who I, uses a condom? I know. I didn't if you're, okay, I'll this say. This thing's been in there. That thing's expired. Yeah. <laughs> they, they don't expire, and that one expired. Um, I'm not big on a condom usage either. It's just, no one is. Anyone Nobody that is. watches this thing of like these guys are dirty. Yeah, these yeah. guys are terrible people. Don't have sex with any of these guys. <laughs> <laughs> but well, I'm, in, our, in our defense, all the girls I fucked, then only this is a true fact. Only the black girls I've ever fucked, they're like, you have a condom. <laughs> every, every, I don't know. I what swear to God, every other, every other. Does every that other mean they're girl, safer? Or I don't know. They're just more careful. Because I feel like they're in the household. They've been more taught to be like, hey, if you're gonna fuck, you know, wear protection. Because they're more open. Yeah. The blacks. Yeah. What and, does that mean? I mean, when I when I do hook up with any other race, I mean, they never really ask for condom. They're dude. just like, dude, is it in yet? I mean, dude, I've had. I've <laughs> had one thing they ask yeah. me is, have is you it in yet? Like, I've came. <laughs> I'm gonna stay play my video game. <laughs> have you started? <laughs> yeah. No. No, uh, I've had girls, like, let me think. Let me think. Okay. I I swear to God, bro, I've had girls where I've said, I've had a condom on me, and I was like, you know, I'm new to this. I'm newly single. I'm going to be safe. I'm going to wear a condom. I was like, I got a condom, and she was like, don't put that on. Yeah, it doesn't make And I'm like, are you fucking serious? Uh, it doesn't feel as good for the girl either. Who is like, she? Yeah. <laughs> she's like, it feel, bro, and I've had. Say her name on this podcast. This is maybe a bit extreme. But the girls are like, just finish in me. And I'm like, no. are you on birth control? And they're like, no. And I'm like, what the fuck goes on and in see, your that's head? how a kid gets born. And then in 10 years, you're fist fighting some fucking person. Because that's why they're I, with that girl. And that's she's why like, abortion's I just a real thing, bro. You know, if, if you know, if plan, and, a, plan A doesn't work, plan B's right here. Yeah. Yeah. <laughs> and if that doesn't work, there's 24 more letters in the alphabet. Like, yeah, we're getting exactly. rid of this kid. Yeah, we're going to find a way. We're going to find a bridge. <laughs> yeah. So, so what, what, my, my question, I guess, with that is, is... Would you rather oh, this is good. not finish inside of a girl and just, you know, think of... Like, if you know she's taking a plan B, I feel like I'd finish inside of a girl then. Like, if I was, like, guaranteed, like, if she had it ready, she was, like, tomorrow morning... I bought so many. Uh, How did, many is so many? There's a difference. I don't know. There's Recently, a difference. Sorry. Recently? Five to ten. Are you serious? Yeah. What? Bought five to ten plan B pills? Yeah. You realize Jesus. you spent about 250 to 500 dollars. That's why I don't want to do it. Anymore. Yeah, but if you have a kid, you'd be spending a lot more. Than yeah. That. No. Yeah. I'm just saying, like, you you could. There's definitely a better option than that. I'm not gonna hit the girl in the stomach. <laughs> oh, I'm not saying that. I'm gonna body kick her like fucking Brandon <laughs> Shaw. Yeah. No, dude. Oh man. I, I just, know, but I mean, I don't. Man, this is the only like push you someone else. This is the only pain. This is the only protection I need right here. Yeah, yeah. Just not AIDS, guys. <laughs> just not AIDS. <laughs> um. 
No, but my thing is like, and you probably heard that and was like, what girl said that to you? It's been like four girls. That we live in Vegas crazy. too, so like, this place is a fucking cesspool of whores, you yeah, know. Bro. I love and that. honestly, like, yeah, I'm, not, I'm thinking about, I'm thinking about two of the girls that have said it. They're not whores at all. I don't know why they said that. Well, who you know? is it? No. Uh, yeah, drop, <laughs> drop their IG, bro. Yeah, yeah. In the comments. Um, no. Like, one of them is the girl that I told you about. Yeah, oh, I know. Oh, no, nah, yeah. nah, I don't fucking know. In, uh, um, recently, like, I don't want to give anything away at all here. Um, she uh, she brought me food to work. Okay, yeah. She's Wait, a good girl. what hours is this human living? <laughs> These guys work from 3 a.m., 2 a.m. to 9 a.m. This girl, this girl brought him a burrito to work at, like, 5 or 6 in the morning. Then she saw how you dress at work? You know what's funny? I told him, bro, this is, I just realized this. This is so funny. When this girl did this, like, I told him, I was like, bro, this is a girl that you marry. This, this is a good girl. Because if she's bringing you food, you know, like, that, and, I, and then, and you know what happened? Text me her name. A couple, couple weeks later, this, this girl buys me a PS5, and I'm like, fuck this bitch. <laughs> No, Fuck yeah. this dumb I bitch. I love you. <laughs> that's why what I... What a dumb and, bitch. And I realized, I was like, I'm so, like, I'm, like, hypocritical because I said that. I was like, oh, like, that's a girl you married for buying you a burrito. That's fucking... Oh, not buying you. She made it herself, actually. She yeah. woke up and did it herself. She made the burrito? Yeah. She made the burrito. Was it good? It was, it was so... Good. Oh, you tried it. What, uh, what was it? Yes. It was Thank huge. You. Thank you. Yeah. yeah. <laughs> Thanks for my burrito. What was in it? Uh, bell peppers. Um, Mexican potatoes. Girl. No. I'm not going to give anything away. Yeah. Uh, it's just a burrito. Bell, <laughs> bell peppers, put, uh, potatoes. Was chorizo in it? Yeah, I think it was a little chorizo, chorizo in it. Chorizo, egg, um, all the whole nine, salsa. Yeah, it was, it really was like a Mexican breakfast burrito. It was fucking gas. Egg? Yeah. yeah the, end, the end was coming apart, and I was just like inhaling it. I was just like. <laughs> <laughs> yeah, yeah, that's how I was eating that shit, too. Mm. Okay. She brought that to work for me. Yeah. Now, when somebody does stuff like that for you, do you assume they're only doing it for you and you should try to pursue this person? Or do you think that they are like, did she have like a bag of 10 burritos and she's like, oh, like <laughs> she my every dick she's sucking. Yeah. yeah. <laughs> no. I knew, oh, yours this was no, salsa. It's that bag you grabbed it I was out telling of. Them, girls don't do that for everybody. If, if she is fucking other dudes, like, she's probably not doing that for, like, the other dudes she's, like, you know, fucking and shit. Some people, like, they get a little bit of extra and shit, you know? Uh I don't know why he's much, the one who gets the extra. I mean, is, how, how good is his dick? I couldn't tell you. Hey, how good is yeah. my dick, Eric? I'll, t- I'll let you know later. Yeah. <laughs> um, I, get, I mean, or but I, don't, I honestly don't think, like, because I know my dick is not the best that my girlfriend has had. There's no way. There's no shot. No, but not a chance. Like, when you like somebody. There's not a chance. Yeah. No, there's not a chance. That no. She's yeah. gotten the okay. best thing she's gotten. We get For it. me, no. No, not even close. Guy. I'd okay, be surprised, if you, I'd be surprised genuinely <laughs> if you're in the top ten. I don't. I just don't know how many people she's had. Because I feel like oh, with girls, hundreds, <laughs> <laughs> not thousands. Um, no, but what I'm saying is, is like, if I feel like no, I th- I disagree with you. Sorry to interrupt you, but I disagree with you because you know, as far as best dick that she's gotten, it's gonna be the guy that she loves the most. Because that, yeah. that sounds crazy, but for, for it sounds women, more gay for guys, crazy. it's like. Was he that one bitch I met that one night at that yeah. one? Yeah, yeah, yeah. She I mean, was literally I'm attached right. to my roof, yeah. and dropping herself <laughs> onto my dick, like yeah. in scary movie yeah. too. Yeah, like, but that's because to women, sex is like, uh, like it's more intimate for them. Like it's like more of like a love thing for us. It's just like we don't see sex that way. We see sex as like, like you know, sex. Like it's fun, it's pleasurable. You know, on like and that's really like if we think about it, like it's like what's the best football game we ever watch? You can like oh like this is the best football game I've. And like sex is the same way. Like you know, if, to us it's like it's gonna be a best, Cowboys game. What's the yeah. best sex? Yeah, what's the best sex you ever had? It was, it was this chick and shit. For girls, it's that moment. You know, it's like oh. Air when, the best when, when he took his underwear off in that did. hot tub, yeah, yeah. Uh, Carl's bad it happened, and, and his friends were barking at us. Yeah. <laughs> um, yeah. No, but I, I actually do think that she's the like the best sex I've had is with her. That's gay. Okay, that's fine. That's very gay to say. Being good at sex is gay. <laughs> yeah, that's, a, that's a gay. No, uh, but I, do, I, you know, I might. Okay, you can call me what you want, but I do gay. feel like you know, it's bit like you can you tell well, what makes it the best because, well, first of all, back room. Yeah, <laughs> gymnastics. No, um, I feel like just from the start, and you know, I feel like you guys are gonna be rude to her about this. But she was more well, Danny for sure. But like, she was more like, like from the start, <laughs> she like said she was more uh, communicative when it came to sex. Like, yeah. oh no, I like, like that. most girls. Like, I had sex with this one girl, and she left, and she was like, like three weeks after, she was like, uh. 
I, you know, I, or not even three weeks, probably like a week later, the next few times we talked, she was like, I don't really like when I get like fingered aggressively or whatever. And I was like, if you would have said that. Yeah, during, I was punching your sack. <laughs> yeah. It's because, I mean, bro, I'm telling you, a lot of guys don't know how to do that. She didn't, I don't want to say aggressively as if I was sitting I in the regular squirt. Right. Yeah. <laughs> Every girl can squirt, actually. Yeah. Yeah. I saw a tutorial. <laughs> She's bleeding. <laughs> Um, Shout out Shane Gillis. No, but she was like, yes, you know, I'm more like slow, whatever. And I was like, I mean, you could have said that. And she was like, yeah. And I'm like, dude, like, I don't think that, like, if you're doing something, because like one thing for me, and I don't know if I want to, you know, how far into this we're getting, but like, I don't really like my balls being sucked on. Yeah, wait, well, I like them being licked. Let's Thanks. stick to like finger. Let's <laughs> well, stick we'll to keep finger, that in mind. But it's like, it's, <laughs> yeah. it's just so like, when your mother comes over later, Danny, tell her to be careful on the balls. <laughs> <laughs> um, what? Yeah. <laughs> But what I'm saying is, is I feel like I'm not really one that's scared to say something. But I feel like with my girlfriend at the moment, we it, from the I don't, start, I don't say anything. I just do it. No, no, no. I'm saying like if so, if somebody was like hurting your dick while they were sucking on it, you wouldn't say like, hey, hey, stop biting my cock. Uh, in a relationship, in a relationship, you you do do that, you know. But when you're when you're fucking just fucking, it's like no, you, I I don't do it. I, I just recently hooked up with a girl, bro, uh, bro, head. One out of ten. Honest to God, I'm not even lying, bro. Teeth and everything, bro. Yeah, what makes bad head what? for you? Uh, Teeth? Teeth and, uh, like, another thing, I'm I'm uncircumcised. A lot of info right there. But, so what uh, is that? What's the difference in that? So, like, a lot of girls on gentle, bro. So they're just, like, you know, like, like just like, like a girl, like, you know, like, uh, getting fingered hard. You know, they're just, like, so rough with it. It's like, it's like, you're, it's like it hurts and shit, you know? And then, like, another thing. What th hurts, the foreskin or the penis itself? The foreskin. Just it like, has, the foreskin has feeling? Well, they'll just be like pulling it all the way back, and then like fucking it'll it'll hurt and shit. You get a rubber band. Yeah. Man. yeah. <laughs> okay. I didn't because I don't know. I am circumcised. Um, but so the head was one out of ten. Was she just like just going back and forth on it like hard? Yeah, she was also fucking hammered. She's always hammered. So, do we know this person? Yeah, he does. <laughs> yeah. I don't. You don't, you don't want to know. This yeah, okay, go. I just she's a, <laughs> you might have seen her under a bridge <laughs> driving up yeah. Las Vegas Boulevard. <laughs> yeah, <she's horrible. laughs> Um, you know how you drive past that bridge and someone asks you for a riddle before you can cross it? Yeah, yeah that'd be her. Yeah, <laughs> I know her. It's, um, not, it's, it's, it's not your proudest moment, you know, but a nuts and nut. Well, because one of our friends, and I don't know, if, I, I don't want to say his name and out him or her. Do he it. said his person gives bad head. You should. They're together. Yeah, they're together. No, they're not together. Oh, well, cares? they're kind of together, that but not too much. Oh. <laughs> <laughs> that was way too much. He knows. I, now. Uh, <laughs> I do know now. You do? She went from here to here. Yeah. <laughs> no, but I'm just saying I don't. I don't really know if, like I said, I don't know how to define what everyone's definition of bad or good head is. Oh. No, no, I mean like, bro, it's we're men. The camera, we're we're we're, keep we're normal. I mean, it's like heads ahead, bro. It's like you know, not nah, it It's not you know. I, there it's was not a, rocket science. Yeah. <laughs> We're not doing rocket science here. It's like, just put uh, your mouth on it, keep your teeth away from it, you Yeah. Know? No, but there, I just oh, there's, 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 there's a form. When you've but, been to areas of the darkness that I've been to. B as well? You got it. There's certain things you need. There's certain I'm, things you need. Yeah, there's yeah. there's a... And I'll say this. Me, me and a, a friend were having a conversation about this. We should start naming these whores. Yeah. <laughs> Internet don't know these And we were, talking about, we were talking about uh, fellatio. And we were talking about... um. How good or bad or this or that. And we both said, like, the girls that say, like, oh, like, you're talking about the, because I've had two girls say to me, like, I've been told I give good, I know, like, you just wait, you're not going to be able to whatever with me, I'll wait till you yeah. whatever, whatever. And but, then they come to town, and I'm like, are you fucking serious? But I feel like the yeah. hype is what gets you I've, I've, I've done that before. No, 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 no. I've done that before. No, I've but had, I feel like they have you ready to think something's going to happen, and then you're like, I don't even know if that's I think true. a lot of it is just like, you know, like, sexting too. They're just trying to, you know, get you excited. Yeah, that's true, you know? that's true. Yeah. Because I had a girl that used to work with me, and she told me she was like, and I knew she was a fucking freak. Yeah. And then she came over, and... I did not last 30 seconds with my dick in her mouth because she was trying. It looked, sound, felt like she was trying to kill herself with my penis. Yeah, that, that, that is a good. That's that good. happens. It was awesome. But, <laughs> uh, yeah. You're like, oh my god. <laughs> that's literally, a, that's a compliment to to her though. You know, it's no, like, yeah. you know, it like it's. But it's not really a compliment to her father. No, it isn't. No, I mean, he should be. But what happened was, so we we went in my room. Uh, I literally turned the movie on. You know, we got put arm around her. She yeah. laid in. And literally, yeah, like, get in there. Yeah, come on. <laughs> so I want to see that one act this out. So I'm, 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 I'm her, actually. We shy. I'm her, so we're watching, right? The movie just starts. What she movie? What movie? Sinister. Sinister. Oh. She literally grabs my pants. I don't know how she got them off. <laughs> got them off. And it was like, <laughs> <laughs> And I was like, dude, Jesus Christ. And then after that, she just jumped up on my face. 
and I had no other choice but to obviously eat her out. And I was right. like, dude, this is like this is a good movie. California, it is a great movie too. I would have and I was pissed because I never, I never saw the movie, so I was like, dude, if we got half an hour in. And you know we could we could play it around and take one. Yeah, yeah. Can I pause the movie? I have well, something. Yeah. Jesus. Yeah, I mean, as a show, she was there for one thing. She's like, fuck. She was, and fuck then I did this you know, movie. Like within a half an hour after, I was like, oh yeah, I, like I said, I got to be up early. To, my uncle's coming to fix my car. Which, yeah. Fix my asshole. Yeah. Yeah. Oh my god. Um, and I was been fixing it since he was. <laughs> yeah. And I literally young just boy. kicked her out of my house, and that was it. Not kicked her out, but I was like, yeah. yeah. But the last chick I hooked up with, I literally, I literally called her at two a.m. Went to her house, did the deed, and was like, I'm leaving now. I was this to... last weekend? Yeah. I heard. Uh, who told you? Yeah. Yeah, the only one man could have told you. Oh, a woman. Oh, yeah. She did. I'm just kidding. <laughs> <laughs> a woman told you? Mm-hmm. Mm. You're overthinking it. Oh, it's mom. Yeah, <laughs> you're really overthinking this. Yeah, she's like this fucking asshole. Two o'clock in the morning, here and brushing his teeth, and he's then he leaves, and I was like, if he's brushing his teeth, I mean, he's, I yeah. mean, not that he's a, you know, monkey, but he's not brushing his teeth to go to Jordan's house or to meet at PT. Like a blow. I just hope you're brushing your balls too, or like washing your balls. No. Two in the morning. Yeah, but I, it's it is funny how. Because I think that girl... Did I, I come actually, home first? I don't think I did. I that. was in L.A. I don't no, know. I think I was actually legitimately home that night. I was in the bank. No, you weren't. You, no, because no, I stayed you at went Jordan's. You went to Jordan's. I stayed at Jordan's all day Sunday, too. And then she said you came home, and then all of a sudden at 2 a.m., which she was down here probably watching some murder mystery, she heard the sink go on. You were brushing her teeth. You came downstairs and said, I'm leaving. Well, maybe she was because she was been sleeping on the couch. Oh! That was after... Yes, it was, yeah. After what? Party, he party. So he probably did come home around. The guy we all, we, party? Yeah, he, yeah, around that time and shit, yeah. Yeah, I was in that right. That was, I wasn't here because I would probably. Came I went home for it. How was that party? Mm. It was cool. It was fun. It was fun. Too many Mexicans, but. <clears throat> okay. Get? Well. <laughs> Cancelled. Cancelled. What are you worried about? We were at one bar on Michael's microphone. Uh, no matter. I'll have it in the uh, headphones. So what? I'll know if he's dead. Well, what I'm saying is, is, should we get another? We should maybe use that microphone, also after his one dies. How we could take a little pause. Dude, oh, I got there was something in there in that conversation. Be fine. You know that zero bars. I think it'll be on for a little bit more. Yeah, I just don't want you. Oh, to. I wanted to touch back on because you said something pretty. It was pretty good. Because man, you know how we are with movies. When we go to watch a movie, if you if your expectations are here, even if the movie's right here, you'll think it's not that great. No, of course. But if your expectations are here, even if it's right here, right? So this movie was here, this movie's here, but the expectation was above and below, you'll yeah. think this movie's better. <coughs> yeah. You know what I mean? So I always go, I try to go in with low expectations. So maybe the hype did have something to do it with does. the bad head, but at the same time. But you know bad head and good head. Come on, bro. But I will say, I went to oh, see. Oh, back to head, I thought you were talking about movies again. <laughs> <laughs> we well, can't get to movies. I was going to say, I went to see the Barbie movie. And yeah. I had the expectation that it was just going to be, I was like, okay, I'm just going here because my girlfriend wants to watch this. Yeah. And she fell asleep like half an hour into it. And we had to like, like, this is good shit. No, we had to leave. Bam. We had to she had like an hour in. She was like, do you want to leave? And I was like, well, dude, there's only 45 minutes left. And this isn't as bad as I thought. <laughs> it actually was not bad. Yeah. And now, see, some, see, like, in that same movie, Fredo at our work, he knows his movies, he knows his shows. That's what I talked to him about. He was like, I heard Barbie was fucking good, bro. I'm going to watch it and shit. And he came in the next day, he's like, that movie fucking sucked ass. It was the worst fucking movie yeah. I've ever seen. Yeah. It was so stupid. So it was like, I was like, yeah, you're going in thinking that it's going to be the best movie ever. It's a Barbie movie, bro. Yeah. It's not like. It's not for every, like, audience and shit. Yeah, you know? It's not for a fucking 32 year old Mexican well, dude. Definitely wasn't work. supposed to be for me. But like, yeah. But yeah. I said, I was like, it wasn't. Because I don't know if you guys know the plot of it. No, but, I don't know. Margot Robbie was Barbie, yeah. and I think that's who it was, right? And she, in the Barbie world, like, <laughs> guys have no, like, kid, like the girls... Girls like, run shit. Girl, like, they, in terms of everything, like, yeah. Barbie didn't even know Ken existed type shit, and then they somehow drove into the real world for something, and then they saw how it was, like... That sounds like, actually pretty good. And then Ken came back and turned Barbie land into, like, that, or was trying to, and then Barbie had to come back and, like, restore it. It wasn't, that's why, I wasn't pretty good. It wasn't good. <laughs> but then they made, some, Barbie plot. they made some jokes, too, like Jake Gyllenhaal, I think, was Ken. And no, was Ryan like, Gosling. <clears throat> yeah, yeah. It's disrespectful. Yeah. I don't know how I got that. Jake Gyllenhaal's in Roadhouse. Yeah. yeah. Um, 
they hit Ryan Gosling and this other dude were arguing on the beach and the guy was like, Do you wanna have a beach off? He's like, I'll beat you off right now. Like there was little jokes where I was like, Oh, I didn't know. I did not yeah. and like, you know, a couple adults laughed and then the kids who were like six and seven, they're like, ha and I was Beat like, you hey, off, what does that mean? It's like no he's idea. gonna suck his cock. Yeah. <laughs> <laughs> and I was hoping it turned into that. Was like our version. Yeah. I kinda of feel like partying right now. <laughs> <laughs> Actually kinda of feel like partying right yeah. now. <laughs> That's the show was amazing, or movie, whatever they turned it into. But um yeah, I think expectations are a big thing for everything in life, you know? Like like you said, if someone says, I'm going to come over there and suck the soul out of your penis, it's you better come. You better do that. Yeah, yeah. right. Yeah. yeah. I have thought if I was a girl that I would give very good head, but I feel like I know what I'm doing. That's guy. Okay, now we'll tap into this. No. So I heard a story. Please not. I heard a story. Please and, not. And someone here might be able to vouch for this. Uh, <laughs> and this, I, was at a, I was on a trip, and this dude was telling me, that he was like, yeah, I was, I was talking to this one chick for a little bit, and there was just something off about her. Like, she never would like... If I FaceTime her, she's always a dark room. Like, if, she, man. if I wanted to hang yes. out at, like, noon, breakfast, whatever, she was like, nah. And then she was like, let's go to a club one time. Like, you know, okay, yeah, we'll go to the club. And she, he was like, all right, I'll pick you up. And she's like, no, just meet me there. And he's like, okay, so you're already going to be in the club when I get there? And she's like, yeah. And he was like, okay. So he's like, he gets there. And he's like, she's taller than I thought she How was. How horny is this man? So he gets there, and she's taller than I thought she was. Club's kind of dark. You know, she's pretty. Like, she looks pretty and stuff, but she's just whatever, you know. Wearing like a turtleneck thing, all this. I'm like, okay, I get where this is going so far. And then he's like, so I take her home. Like we're making out, everything's good. Take her home, and like as we're like messing around, I try to feel down there, and she's like, nah, you know. But she's grabbing on my shit, and I'm like, what? And then she just gives me head, and he was like, it was the most amazing head ever. And then I was like, all right, I'll, I'll return the favor. She's like, no, I'm good, and just dipped. And I was like, huh? I think that was a fucking man that just sucked my penis. But he never got confirmation. No, but that's a man, I think. Yeah, yeah. and he and, I, and then and he started telling the story. I was like, what, "What? Like what? Like?" I asked him a question about it. Yeah, he was like, and he was like, "Yeah, you know, he just went like that." And I was like, "Hey, don't say he now, Jesus Christ!" Yeah. This yeah. is really getting gay. Yeah, yeah. He's starting to talk about this person like a man. He, a he, yeah, and he was just like, and I was like, "Dude, I is think that's me." No, <laughs> <laughs> no, it wasn't. And he was like, "Yeah, everything gave it away." He was like, "That was a dude. Her hands were bigger than mine," and uh, I was just like, "Man." It's like you could tell her voice was being put on. Like it was like, "Hey, how you doing?" You know, it was like, like, a, like, "Hey, how's it going?" You know, and it's like it was pretty good, but it was like, "You're doing an accent." He, he knew that shit right away. He, still he was like, "Oh, about the head." Yeah, yeah. That's how horny guys are, bro. We don't give a fuck. I don't think I would. We'll fuck each other, dude. Not these two. I don't think I would have done that. Because it's man. When I was younger, I feel like some some similar happened to me like that, bro. I was hitting on this lady at the gas station. You know, she was like. Uh, you know, she was like giving me play and shit. She gave me her number. A, a week went by. I went to her house. We went to her bedroom. Same, sil- yeah, similar. She had a situation. poster of Michael Jordan on the wall. <laughs> yeah, no. But I'm, I'm telling you, this lady was bad, bro. And like, you can. And she. Similar situation, bro. She sucked me up. I went, reach around, try to like, you know, grab her ass and shit. You know, she kept slapping my hand away. She fucking put me on the way and shit, you know. And she did that a couple times until I was like, you know, I was like, nah, no more. How many See, trophies did she have in her room? Yeah. I'm just saying, I even me, I went there back a couple times. Pee wee football. Shit, so you, you know? might have got blown <laughs> by a dude a couple multiple times. Does it? If you came out right now, if you walked through honest that door, honest to God, I would do. I, honest to God, I had no idea until I watched the video of this uh, veteran talking about in Vietnam. <laughs> like no, she he was talking about no, I swear to God, <laughs> and it was her. <laughs> yeah. Well, listen, he was talking about when, when they were in Vietnam and shit, like like when they used to fuck like uh, prostitutes and shit, you know. Yeah. And like that was the move like the lady boys did and shit. Like or like, you know, because they used to slap their hand away. Like and like later on they found out I was like like that's they, they found out those are like dudes and shit. Well know? there's no other and, way. And, to and, do and it. I was like, Oh shit, that happened to me and I was like I was like, Maybe it's just coincidence, maybe I'm fucking I mean the only other way probably I'm better is be putting you in an arm bar. So it's yeah. either slap me away my hand away or full blown kick my ass. I'm like, dude, I have a cock, leave me alone, you know. I feel like that's the only because you're like that's the way they. That's how they do it. It's like there's not really. Yeah. Besides telling you straight up, like. Dude, well, the deed's been done. Me. There's no point being mad at it now. You know yeah. what I mean? Like it's just it's over with. Yeah. Don't look and don't look for the answers. No. <laughs> but I'm just saying. Let's say you know you ran into that person in the street and they were like, oh hey, by the way, I'm yeah. a full blown dude. Would yeah. They have a, you... they have a fade and a yeah. buzz cut. Would that make you feel any type of way or no? I mean, I have to fuck you up, bro. Because yeah. Cause oh, you, you would. Well, because it's like this. Genuinely speaking, like. 
bro, you can't do that. You I'm know saying, what I mean? Like, man, it you can't about fake that. who you are to fuck so. I can't. That's like that's similar to like me being like, yeah, I'm 17. And I go into a high school. You know what I mean? It's like I don't think that's similar at all. It, no, it's similar, bro. Because you're faking who you are. You're, you're being deceived. Bro. You fake who deceiving. you are all the time when you try to get a girl. Like, if yeah, but you make it seem like you're a nicer no, than you different. are. But even even then, you don't not, make it seem not, like you're a. You're like, not telling girls. You're not out here telling girls like. Some wild shit, like no, nah, no. Nah. When it's the same, it's, when it's different sexes hitting on each other, it's kind of different because that's what we do, you know. I've told girls, girls at Fremont you know? with me and Danny that we are business owners. Yeah, yeah. I mean, I've, I've told girls like I own multiple properties and shit. Well, that's, that's that's lying about. about that's I'm lying. Fucking, I'm never gonna see these horrors again, you know. But that's lying about who we are to an extent. I feel like. Yeah, but I'm saying no, no. Lying about that, that goes deeper, bro. Would you rather be a child on Epstein's Island or an adult? So, what gen would you rather be on? The people know. Nobody knows. <laughs>